Montreal Canadiens Camp Day 3 Prospects Shine. The third day of Montreal Canadiens training camp brought some intriguing developments, particularly among the team's prospects. While all eyes were on Logan Mayu and Juraj Slavkovsky after their previous struggles, it was Jarrett Davidson who stole the show with an impressive performance. Davidson, who played five seasons in the WHL with the Seattle Thunderbirds, made a strong case for himself during Friday's practice. With three goals against Team White, it was undoubtedly his best day since joining the Canadians. His remarkable shooting ability and work ethic demonstrated why he was drafted by the Canadians, suggesting a potential future with the Laval Rockets. Juraj Slavkovsky, on the other hand, had a better outing compared to the previous day. Recognizing that he hadn't played since January, it was expected that he would need some time to regain his form. Slavkovsky continued to skate on a line with Josh Anderson and Alex Newhook, but displayed a much improved pace and intensity. He drove to the net aggressively, delivered several precise passes, and overall looked more comfortable on the ice. David Reinbacher, an 18-year-old prospect, has been making a strong impression at camp. Coach MSL praised Reinbacher's poise and decision-making, emphasizing that his ability to make quick, effective decisions is at an elite level. These qualities bode well for Reinbacher's future in the league. Logan Mayu, who had a rough start, bounced back with a notable performance, scoring two goals. His ability to find shooting lanes and his precise timing for taking shots from the blue line were evident. Although there is room for improvement in his defensive play, Mayu offensive contributions were more in line with his OHL performances. Mike Matheson stood out during the practice, showing impressive speed and puck movement. He seemed to be in mid-season form, contributing significantly to offensive plays and demonstrating the same level of performance seen in the latter half of the 2022-23 season. The duo of Brendan Gallagher and RHP continued to exhibit strong chemistry, resembling each other's play style. After two days together, they developed a solid connection on the ice, raising questions about whether Coach St. Louis will keep them together. Could the youngest help the oldest? In this context, the answer seems to point towards the affirmative as Gallagher tries to revive the final stretch of his career. 100%. That's the way it is in hockey. Guys are always pushing. It brings out the best in everyone. It's always a positive thing, replied Gallagher without hesitation when we more often expect the opposite. Galley, he talks a lot on the ice and in the locker room. It helps to have advice from a veteran. I can learn a lot by being around him about how to act off the ice. He's a veteran, described RHP, who often identified Gallagher as an inspiration during his rise to the NHL. I showed that I could play on a line with them, but I want to concentrate on my game without looking too far ahead, said the 24-year-old left-hander. One standout observation from the camp was the exceptional chemistry between Josh Anderson and Alex Newhook. Their speed and synergy on the ice were palpable, making them the most promising duo of the camp so far. Slavkovsky capitalized on their partnership, netting a goal with their support. Coach MSL is keeping a keen eye on this line, intrigued by the dynamic combination of speed and skill, leaving the possibility open for all three players to start the season together. Honorable mentions go to Jakub Novak, Philip Massar, and Leas Anderson, who also had their moments during the practice session. The Canadians are set to return to the ice on Saturday before their scrimmage game on Sunday at 1 p.m., where Team White will face Team Red at the Bell Center. The competition among prospects and veterans promises an exciting season ahead.
Thanks for watching another video of the Ab Daily News with the Hockey Coach Group Code Frenchy. But before we leave, we invite you, please don't forget to click on the like, subscribe to the Hockey Nation Live Show, and leave us a comment about this episode. And of course, you have greatness inside of you. And we wish you an amazing, great blessing day, everybody. 